Yo, it's Jess. Welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, welcome. If you're returning subby, what's up, sis? Happy Wednesday. Just kidding. Happy Tuesday. And I am headed to the doctor's office, the orthopedic, to check on this knee in front of mine. So we can come to terms on what we need to do. My appointment is actually now. Um, I am four minutes away. It's 4.04. I was supposed to be there at 4 o'clock. So it's saying I'll show I'll make it at 4 08. Um so we gotta see what's gonna go on about this knee. I have been in so much pain, y'all. When I say so much pain, I mean walking on it is beginning to be extra terrible. So um I'm going to ask about a few concerns. Number one, and y'all may think this is very extra, but I need to see if I can get a, um, hmm, how do I want to say it? Um, a temporary, yeah, it'll be temporary. So a temporary handicap sticker. I just had to park in the back of the parking lot um, because I had to run in Hobby Lobby and get a box. Had to park in the back of the parking lot and I just walked all the way up on crutches. Baby, when I tell you out of breath, sweating, all that stuff. My arm has a bruise under it because I, I want to show y'all too. Like, I'm not, am I going to be able to show y'all? It's somewhere in that area, but my arm is bruised. I don't know if y'all can tell, but my arm is bruised from having the crutches under it. Number one, I don't think I'm doing it right. Number two, the cushion on it really ain't cushiony. cushiony. And number three, she told me to put all my weight on one side and I have been doing so. So that's why I'm like, it's a lot of things why I may be hurting. Um, I mean, oh, this person tried to get over and they, oh, did someone just get hit? Oh, she ain't letting her over. Oh gosh. Let me get off this phone, y'all. I'll talk to y'all when I get to the doctor's so office. Uh -uh. Look. Hey, give me my stuff. Yeah. Addie, Gracie, but look, look, she's fighting. Look, she said, give me my stuff. Look at her, she's digging at her feet. <laughs> we are walking in Target. It is 8 o'clock, almost 59. It is 9 o'clock, actually. It's past 9 o'clock. We are in here trying to get last minute stuff. We go to the McWayne Science Center tomorrow um, for Allen's Spotlight Field Trip. So, yeah. When I get home, I'll update y'all about the doctor. Good morning. It is 6 a.m. And we are about to head out and get on the bus for the trip to Birmingham. I have on, girl, look like I don't have pants on. <laughs> I just got on the athleisure set. It's supposed to be mauve top and mauve bottom. I mean, I don't know if it really looks that way. But yeah, we're about to go to the, on the field trip. Um, got my little mama earrings on ring i got silver accessories y'all know i usually never wear silver y'all can't see whatever i usually never wear silver accessories but today is today alan what's up fam i really need to get a cover for this bed and these silk sheets y'all huh, baby listen baby they be slipping and sliding y'all look how pretty this sunrise is it is so orangey and stuff we stopped to get some snacks. Hot everything. <laughs> Hot everything. Y'all, and somebody missing a baby po thing. Look. Okay, pit stop so that the drivers can go to the bathroom, but this is the same truck stop we come to every year when we go to Destin. Even Alan remembers. <laughs> He thinks he's cool. He's not. I'm what? I'm not what? You think you cool? Are you cool? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Girl. <laughs> <laughs> Look, y'all, it's Nemo and Dory. <laughs> Turtles up there. The 
this winter, y'all see? <laughs> One down here too. Is this a shark? That's a shark too, I think. They're all under. Ooh. Say like oceans on the move. And this is so pretty. Yeah, I know this is like a luster dust and soap, but that is beautiful. Okay, we just had lunch. Now we are, looks like the dino exhibit. Okay, pay attention, pay attention. Gotta go, go. <laughs> <laughs> Did you get caught? Oh, you didn't get caught. Go, Alan, go. You won. <laughs> Come on, Alan. We're supposed, we supposed to be looking through it. What is this? A bug? A beetle? Huh? real in there. You think it's real? Yep. I don't know if it's real. Ooh. It really look nasty. Oh gosh. Hey Mr. Buggy 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 Bug. What is this? Do it. Wait, Come on, Alan, jump. So satisfying. Oh, it hit you in the head, boy. Oh, you almost got it. Hmm. One more time. Let's do it. Oh, hold your jacket. Okay. All right. The jacket is holding them back. The jacket holding them back. Come on. Let's go. Nope. It might not be the jacket, my boy. Oh. to the house we go. Hey friends, happy Thursday. I have a booming headache, okay? When I say booming, my headache is on 10. Um, we had a good time yesterday. I didn't talk to y'all after we got back. Oh, my head is extremely big, okay. Okay, anyway. <laughs> uh, I had to screenshot that cover. Y'all see that on the cover, I'm more than sure. Um, I had a good time yesterday at the museum. <sighs> I'm burnt out, <clears throat> tired, very much so tired. Alan is now sick, unfortunately. Um, yeah, he actually was picked up early by AJ today from school because it did not feel good. So we're about to milk that. Alan, your clothes aren't dirty. You only wore, wore them for like an hour this morning. Your clothes aren't dirty. You only wore them for like an hour. Your t-shirt has a stain on it, so that has to go in a hamper, though. Okay? You understand? Alan? Headphones on. Act like you can't hear me. Um, but, yeah, he got picked up this morning. Um, some kids on the bus from yesterday had strep, and I rebuke and refuse to go through being sick again. I have a crazy weekend, crazy good weekend. Um, I have orders I got to get out. Um, 
I got to bake a heart cake tonight um, for tomorrow. Tomorrow is Corey's mama's birthday. So we're going over my brother-in-law and sister-in-law's house tomorrow night. When I get home from work, I'm probably going to get home more than straight this time. We're going to take a bath, freshen up, and we're going to get to that side of town tomorrow. Saturday is the Giddy Up Galentine's event. My all women's pop-up shop. Super excited. Mm-mm-mm. -mm. Um, and Sunday is Super Bowl Sunday. So I'm excited <clears throat> for that. So we have a lot. Oh, oh, oh. Saturday is Giddy Up Galentine's. I have to be at the church at 8 a.m. The event is until 4. Pretty sure we'll be out of there by 5. My uncle is throwing a pre-Super Bowl party. So we're going over there later on that day. And it's not Thanksgiving, no. Um, and after that, like I said, we'll be going over there. It doesn't start until like six or seven. So we're probably going to show up at about seven. Um, and they're frying fish and all that kind of stuff. Like I said, pre-Super Bowl party. Cause, um, my uncles from Kansas will be here. <sighs> and Sunday we will be going, I think we're still going to Dave and Buster's if I'm not mistaken, um, to a Super Bowl party there. Um, that's being hosted by the Omega. So, yeah. Trying to see how that's going to go. I got a busy, 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 busy weekend. Um, what are you doing? So, yeah. I got cakes to bake. <clears throat> I'm about to take some for my headache. I'm about to nurse Alan a little bit. Um, and I'm about to get it together. I cooked chili last night. So, I'm going to let that be the leftovers. You girl... I ain't gonna cook today so yeah i will see y'all in a minute because i gotta show you something okay i'm back so let me show y'all this is my first time my first time and come continue to do it i did a walmart delivery order i bet y'all like girl okay and i do a delivery order all the time i'm usually the girl that goes in the store or i do pick up today I gave myself a little bit more, a little luxury, and I got them delivered, and I'm excited about that because $10, I'm going to spend that on eating something, I'm going to spend it on some earrings, I'm going to spend it on something else, and I spent that on getting my grocery delivered to my home. I told y'all 2024 and beyond is about luxury, honey. We are, we're making, we're, we're making life luxury, and we're going to make it easier on ourselves. So, let's go through a grocery haul. I got ginger ale because we were clearly out. I got a 36 count egg. I got mini ginger ale too because we definitely needed those. I got kiwi so I can do kiwi and pineapple bowls, like fruit bowls or whatever. Yeah, fruit bowls. I got pineapple. Ooh. They gave me the wrong pineapple. They gave me the big thing. I asked for the little thing. They gave me pineapple. That looks good. That looks good. Mom, <clears throat> I got strawberry icing. Strawberry icing? I'm gonna pull y'all up a little bit closer. Okay, I had to put y'all up a little bit closer. Mm -hmm. I got seasonings. I got some butter, buttery. Burger blend of the Kinder seasoning. I want to try these because these are on sale. Red jalapeno Kinder seasoning. Oh, right here. That's my girl there. Love it. Screenshot that. Get you some. I got some vanilla. I got some cinnamon rolls. I'm going to make a king cake with these. I'm going I'm to cheat it, okay? I'm cheating the same thing. I got some butter because I got to make homemade buttercream. I got these because y'all know the kids love those. Chocolate almond bark. Chocolate almond bark. <clears throat> Put that stuff to the side. I got red velvet cake mix. I got chocolate cake mix. I mean, chocolate icing because I'm going to make a football cake. 
And I got some boop, chocolate cake for the football cake. Two bags of powdered sugar. Two bags of powdered sugar. <clears throat> I also got three boxes of strawberry cake mix. This is my favorite cake mix, y'all. I love the new packaging. I got two things of lemon cake mix because I gotta make a lemon um, velvet cake to take to my uncle's house this weekend. And last but not least, we have one, two, and three boxes of good old white cake mix. So yeah, that is our one more order. I'm about to put stuff up and let's get to baking. Happy Saturday, y'all, and it is event day. I am in Walmart trying to get press on nails and ribbon for my hair so I can tie a cute little bow to give it the coquette, coquette full feel. Y'all know what I'm talking about. I've been seeing, I've been down the rabbit hole with the con, conquete, a conquete, I'm not sure what it's called, but Walmart has changed. Our Walmart has definitely put new stuff out and they have changed the store all the way around. So you're a little lost, but I'm not going to record the Giddy Up Galentine's event on this vlog. It will be a, see, are those it? No, those aren't it. I'm looking for those, uh, is uh, like AV of AVIV shoes, like the Walmart brand shoes that went viral that look like New Balance. They're looking for those. But um, I am in here looking for, um, oh my gosh, y'all, the press on nails and ribbon and it's something else. So, uh, ADHD brain. I'm not going to, I'm going to make the vlog for the, um, the Giddy Up Galentine's event, a separate event. I'm not going to do it on here because I want it to have its own event, okay? So, we are about to go ahead and get what we need out of here, and I'm about to leave. Now, Rosa has been telling me about these. So, she'll be at the event today. So, I am about to get her some of these. These are the scallop ones, and I think this is the color that she said she needed. So, probably going to get some myself because I think they're cute. Like I said, they're 50 cents, so. Anyway, I'll see y'all when I get ready to start setting up and getting all this stuff together. Walked around the corner and look what's here, but let me tell you how dirty Walmart is. This cup was $6.88 at first, and now that they have went viral, people are now buying it. But it matches my dishes, and it's cute for spring, so I'm gonna get fed, okay? I did not come in here for this, but okay, Walmart, what's up? These are so pretty. These aren't my color green, but these are very pretty, especially for fall. It's not for fall, for spring. It's giving me all the spring vibes. Okay, we are here. All the tables are set up. The stage is set up for our speakers. And I'm excited for today. It is nasty outside, but in the inside it's comforting. So yeah, let's let's get this table set up. Ooh, y'all like it. Ooh. Okay, let's get the table set up. Yep, I got my crutch. Okay, y'all, vendors are popping in. We have the balloons being set up by my friend Maggie. And they are getting ready to start setting up. I'm excited. Brittany stuff is over there. Oh, you know, wow. I was just standing here like, who else was I supposed to have? <laughs> How old are you, y'all? Three years old. Are they not here? They're not here? Going once. Eight, six, zero, 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 six. I probably could just call the last three digits, huh? Uh, zero. They should be here. Zero, one, zero. Woo! We got it. All right, till next time. Four as well, okay? Whatever you want from things, you have to learn to release stuff because sometimes when we hold it in, it keeps us in bondage, okay? So if we release it, if we get it out, that's how you begin to get free 
And that's how you begin to walk in your freedom, to walk in your healing. Had I held all that in, I probably wouldn't be no good. Okay? That was a very traumatic accident for me. I could have been in a crazy house. I could have been taking medicine. I didn't have to do any of that. I just had to get admitted to Whitfield. I live in uh, Florida, so it's close to Jackson. So I didn't have to get admitted to Whitfield. I didn't have to take medicine. No purpose. Be who God has called you to be. It doesn't matter who doesn't support you. It doesn't matter who you, you know, who's not there for you like you think they should be. Still go forth and walk and do it. Be who God has called you to be. All right? I love y'all. Oh, to love him more and believe I stuff always has to be so chaotic but um i'm leaving target and i'm headed to do a setup for miss lashonda remember i told y'all i had to set up for her baby's birthday um so 
I am leaving to do that now. Um, I had to stop at Target to get one more thing for the setup. And I'm not feeling my best. The medicine that I'm on for my leg is causing me to be super nauseated. Like, I'm talking about it's bad. Um, so, yeah, I had to stop. I had I got a Sprite. I got some water. And I tried to eat something to see if that was going to make me feel better. Um, the event yesterday was great. Um, it could have been better. It was raining 100%. Like, 100% right. It rained from the time we walked in the building until we left the building. Um, and that was a bummer, but we cannot control God's weather. So, we're not going to complain about it. Um, Brittany and I walked around and we talked about, um, about the event. Like, talked to different uh, vendors. I was like, you know, how would you like the event? And all that kind of stuff to make sure everybody was cool and um everybody was like yeah it was good but you know there's always a couple people um that aren't always going to be happy and you know that says it as expected but when you are in the small business world and you go to pop-up shops um every pop-up shop won't be a sellout show that's coming from me being a small business owner um, it's been plenty of pop-up shops. It's been a bust. It's been plenty of pop-up shops I've sold out. So, you have to kind of, you know, you got to kind of um, take a chance. Sad to say. But in this business world, small business world, you got to take a chance. So I am about to head on. Um, last night after the pop-up shop, we went to my uncle's house. They fried fish and um, salad and spaghetti and lobster tails and, you know, all that type of stuff. But Miss Daddy Girl, y'all know she's allergic to everything, had an allergic reaction due to the Cajun seasoning that was being used. And uh, AJ had to run out and find a Walgreens near my uncle's house and get Benadryl. We're going to have to take her to get allergy tested again because I'm not sure what's going on. Um, we literally can't eat anything at the house. We eat the same old foods day after day. We got, we got through it. So, got to figure out what's going on with her. Uh, today is Super Bowl Sunday. Hence the shirt. It just says game day or whatever. Um, we are going to Dave and Buster's. Um. Uh, and that's gonna be it when I leave here I'm going back home I'm taking me a hot long shower I want to get in the tub so they like sit down in the tub but it is hell and hot water trying to get out of there due to my knee so I haven't even sat down in the tub like I've been standing in the shower and just letting the water like run and hit me all in the face because I need it so bad but yeah, y'all, happy Sunday. The weekend has been crazy, crazy, crazy. But I'm thankful for it all. So yeah, I'm about to go ahead and get to Miss Lashonda's house, decorate for her daughter. And um, yeah, I will see y'all when I see y'all. <laughs> Walking all in front of me. Cause look at it. <laughs> look at my crutch. <laughs> I feel like an old lady. How you feel about me on this crutch, Alan? Ah. Oh, whatever. Alright, let's go in here. You gotta eat first, not play first. <laughs> Yeah. 
Well, y'all, my baby's been towed away. Hopefully they get it fixed. But she's leaving. This is the best thing that was ever created. Walmart. See that time. It is 5.59 a.m. My kitchen is horrible. My living room is pretty nasty too. It's time to clean up, so I'm going to give myself 45 minutes to an hour to get my kitchen and everything back in order because, baby, what's going on here? Nowhere with this cleaning thing. I haven't made it nowhere. Um, I did clean the microwave out, wipe down my stove, wipe down my countertops, all that stuff, just to fill my countertops back up because I am about to start baking for tomorrow. Tomorrow's Valentine's Day, um, and I have a lot of orders to get out. But I am about to end this vlog because it's been going on for a minute. I'm sorry that it's not long, y'all. I have really been slacking when it comes to vlogging, and I don't know what's going on with me, but I gotta get it together, and I gotta get this guy ASAP. I told y'all my plans were to have like a, why is this cooking like this? Y'all know my plans were to have like a, I don't know why it's doing it, y'all. Um, my plans were to have a vlog once a week and like, um, this is content, but, um, like some kind of like an informative video or something like that. I cannot catch up. Working is really doing it for me. <laughs> I understand why content creators and business owners, you know, have to donate or dedicate 100% of this to themselves and it don't make any better that i'm on a crutch because i'm really not getting around like i can like i should so it's kind of hard to maneuver through things um but yeah I, i'm trying i'm gonna do better i promise um so um yeah we're gonna close out this vlog and i have a giveaway coming up with cricket i have a giveaway coming up for cricket uh well with cricket for um uh, National Women's Month, y'all need to make sure that y'all stay tuned for the month of March. That's all I'm going to say. Women's History Month. I said Women's History Month. I think I said it wrong. Anyway, it's Women's History Month. So make sure that y'all stay tuned and because, yeah, it's a big giveaway with Cricket and y'all don't want to miss this giveaway, y'all. So, yeah. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe to the channel, y'all. I promise this is the last little dilly dally vlog. Spring is coming. We're about to get back into decorating. I am about to actually get her up out of here. Y'all see it's leaning? It's leaning bad. Or is it the bow? I don't know, but we're leaning. So we're going to get her up out of here. Um, and like I said, spring is coming. And I'm super excited to get out some colors and new florals and all that kind of stuff. Um, and I think we're going to put some color in here for spring and summer. Y'all know we're on our little yellow. Well, that's the only yellow. It's just for the pop color. But y'all know we're in our greens and our black and whites and browns. And we're going to put some color in the house because, yeah. Because, yeah, it's spring and it's going to be summer and we want it to be cute and we want it to be inviting even though nobody comes to visit us we want it to still be inviting for us you know you walk in your house and you see that it's happy you are happy so yeah i love you guys like i said if you haven't subscribed already make sure you subscribe to the channel i would love to have you a part of my family but that's your women should for the week peace